Welcome to TaxKenya.com Educational Podcast. Tax made easy. Hello dear listeners, my name is Dr. Wakagui Wakebuli. This is part 2 of the four part series of how to establish net VAT balance for a tax period. Today's topic is on zero VAT balance and nil VAT balance. Let us start with zero VAT balance. Sometimes the net VAT balance from the VAT analysis is a zero balance. This means that the output VAT less input VAT and VAT credit carried forward from previous month is zero. Therefore, there is no tax to pay. But why is the VAT net balance zero? The zero balance is because of one of the following three reasons. Uh, reason number one, output tax is equal to the input tax plus any VAT credit carried forward. For example, Assuming that the output VAT is Kenya shillings 10,000, the input VAT is Kenya shillings 6,000, and the credit carried forward is Kenya shillings 4,000, the VAT balance for the month is output VAT less input VAT less VAT credit carried forward, which would give us 10,000 minus 6,000 minus 4,000, which is equal to zero hence the net vat balance for the tax period is zero the other reason that is reason number two, is because output vat is equal to the input vat and there is no vat carried forward for example if we assume that the output vat is 10000 input vat is 10000 credit carried forward is zero The VAT balance for the month is output VAT less input VAT less VAT credit carried forward which would give us 10000 minus 10000 minus 0 which is equal to 0. Hence the net VAT balance for the tax period is 0. The third reason is because output VAT is equal to the VAT credit carried forward and there is no input vat for example if we assume that the output vat is 10000 input vat is 0 credit carried forward is 10000 the net vat balance in the month will be output vat less input vat less vat carried forward which would give us 10000 minus 0 minus 10000 which would be equal to 0 Therefore the net VAT balance for the tax period is zero. Now once the taxpayer has established the net uh, VAT balance as zero, the taxpayer is required to log into the iTax and complete the VAT uh, monthly return with all the details from the VAT analysis and upload the file when it is due. Failure to submit the zero for three monthly return by the due date attracts fines now what about nil balance sometimes the net vat balance for the month is nil what is this and how does it happen this happens where the taxpayer did not transact any business during the month there were no sales and there were no purchases during that calendar month now why nil balance this is because the output vat is zero input vat is zero and the vat carried forward is zero and therefore the net vat balance for the month will automatically be zero this means that there is no tax to pay however the taxpayer is expected to log into the itax and complete the vat monthly return with details from the monthly VAT analysis and upload the file when it is due. Failure to submit the nil for three monthly return by the due date will attract a fine. Uh, this is part 2 of the four part uh, series on how to establish net VAT balance for a tax period. For more on the various tax topics, log into www.taxkenya.com 
or taxkenya.com shows in YouTube or follow us on Twitter at taxkenya. Once again, my name is Dr. Wakagui Wakiburi. Till next time. Thank you.